Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I am giving you all an update on the paneling. This video has far exceeded my expectations. A lot of you all like this video and have found this video beneficial. A year ago, I updated the paneling in my home and I filled it in with joint compound and painted over it to make it look like drywall for under $30. Yes, I said under $30. So it's been over a year and I want to give you all an update. But before we jump into that update, I want to say if you like this video, go ahead and give it a huge thumbs up. And if you like DIY content, home renovation content, go ahead and subscribe to my channel because we are still in the process of renovating the home. So let's go ahead and jump into that update. Okay, so this is what it looks like as you're walking into the space. Um, this is what the room just when you pan around. It looks really good to the eye. Like it looks like the drywall. So this wall here is actually drywall and this one is what I updated this is the paneling underneath there and no problems as you can see everything is holding up the only thing i do regret is the painting so let me show you an area y'all have asked if i had any issues or any texture so right here i had it the paneling was a little bit further out so it wasn't fully aligned so this was actually like this when i originally did it and it's pretty much just held since then but other than that that's like the only issue that i have but it was like that once i first did the paneling it wasn't something that developed over time so that's what that looks like so if you get up close on the wall you can see like it's a little bit of texture it's not um going to be like really flat or anything like that because i mean it is a painted paneling wall and the paneling had texture on it so you kind of see those lines a little bit So I really haven't had any major problems. I would recommend doing this paneling um, update. It's very affordable. For me personally, I was able to do it under $30. You know, if you have already have tools and stuff like that. So uh, that was not including the paint. So have I had any cracking? No, I have not had any like ma major cracking or anything like that. I've showed you, uh, of course the wall looks kind of textured. It is paneling underneath there. Now it's not gonna look exactly like drywall. It's an update. It's something that kind of makes it looks like it, but not exactly the same thing. So it has a little bit of texture, but you can't see it to uh, the naked eye. I think you have to look, get up like really close to see that texture. My neighbor actually walked in the house the other day i was up doing the fireplace over and the paneling was still behind there once i removed it she didn't know that we had paneling in this room um so a lot of people you have to tell them like oh it was paneling in this room for them to even notice the only thing that i am going to do over in this room is i'm going to repaint this room i used flat paint when i originally did the paneling update and i don't like the flat paint it just holds a lot of stains in this room has a lot of uh, traction and a lot of people and guests that comes into it so um, the walls are getting a little dirty and as you know it's really hard to clean flat paint so we will be repainting it but I wanted to give you all the update before I repainted it and show you all exactly what it's looking like post a year after we've done it it actually has been over a year because I posted that video a couple of months after I did it so this is what it's looking like it's holding up really well and i probably would do this again if i had another room but this was the only room in the house that had paneling so um yeah i recommend doing it i feel like it was affordable if you don't have the money to replace all your walls with drywall and a lot of people have multiple rooms that have this so it's a cheap affordable fix and it holds and it lasts on so just make sure that you get a good reliable joint compound and that'll probably save you in the future for having to get something very um with cracking and stuff like that so make sure you do your search guys thanks so much for watching this video i hope this painting update has been beneficial to you personally um if you like this type of videos i do diys and updates on my home as i continue to renovate it we are nowhere done in the renovation process so if you like that type of content go ahead and Subscribe to my channel as I continue to do makeovers and DIYs and stuff within the home. Also, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a huge thumbs up. I'll see you all in my next video. Bye!